Hey, this is Andrew Sharp. I'm on my way to uh, Congressman Baron Hill's office to uh, talk to his secretary, Jason, and to give him this book. Because I think it'll help him uh, make up his mind about becoming a co-sponsor in H.R. 1207. So maybe I can talk some sense into him. And they don't allow video, camera, video taping or audio taping inside, but uh, I'll try to get a little bit of footage if I can. Um, so wish me luck. So I just got uh, out of Baron Hill's office talking to his uh, secretary, uh, Jason, about H.R. 1207. Um, and he said he has been getting uh, a lot of, uh, you know, people talking to him about this, people coming into his office. He said he remembered us coming in with the petitions, and uh, so that had an effect. And he said it's definitely on their radar, so that's good. Um, he said that, um, you know, Baron Hill's not exactly uh, positive on the issue. Um, I asked him if he had any questions for me, you know, if I could clear anything up, if he had any worries about it. Um, he didn't really know anything. He said he had to do a little bit of homework on it himself. But he did say that um, since Baron Hill's a blue dog Democrat, which is, you know, the conservative Democrats, he would want to know what the blue dog caucus had to say about it. So I didn't think about that, but that's smart. If you look for... Uh, any caucuses or any organizations that your uh, congressman is a part of, find out what their stance on it is and try to get them to support it. Um, and, and then, you know, because they're loyal to that organization, they'll, they'll have to support it then too. So my next thing is to get on the Blue Dog Coalition and to uh, start getting in their ears about it. And maybe through that, they can put out something and then that'll encourage Baron Hill to do it even more. So. That's my next step, but I gave him the book, and he said he'd check it out and then send it to the uh, congressman. And so, it was a good meeting. You guys should all do this if you can. Try to set up a, you know, if you can't meet with your congressman, you might as well meet with somebody who sees him all the time and talks to him and can talk to him about what you have to talk about. So, it's really worth it. So, alright, signing out.